So this is one of the coolest clusters I think I've been to this year. Uh, this is where 9-5 appeared to have been cannibalizing a wolf pup that died. So when I showed up, I'll turn this around, I found this huge disturbance, which is full of hair and then cracked bones like that. Um, clearly is wolf hair. I could see wolf tracks in the snow around here, so I followed uh, the tracks. And these weren't by a cluster, but I just followed the tracks about 40 meters this way. And the trail is right here. You'll see my tracks as I continue walking through this. There you can actually see one of the tracks right there, another one right there, so you clean it this way. I came up here where the tracks curl to the left here and found this area that appeared to be disturbed in this in the snow here. So I stopped and I looked, and as I looked, I could see there was digging underneath the tree as though something had been cached. So I started going through it with a stick. And when I did, I found the pup skull that 9-5 had cached in here. So this was totally buried when I showed up here. Now we can try to get it out, but we can see here as we try to get this out, the entire head of this pup. This pup has clearly been dead for a while as the fur and everything is rotting. Um, but nonetheless, it's a wolf pup. Uh, so another pup did not make it from the Weopka Lake pack.